This is the largest study looking at how digital pathology compares with our conventional technology, which is microscopes and glass slides. We've effectively proved that pathologists are as good with a digital system as they are with a microscope. The main advantages of digital pathology really involve how the work is moved around from place to place. Um, in pathology, we don't just have histopathologists that report everything. We have histopathologists that do breast cancer, urology cancer, I do respiratory and skins. Uh, and each, each, of our, uh, each of our consultants has their own area of expertise. What digital pathology does is allows you to collect work from other sites and give it to them to do. So it increases the efficiency with which they work because they work naturally more quickly in the areas they're most familiar with. Uh, and that's really where digital pathology offers uh, a great advantage at the moment. We anticipate uh, that in a few years time, we will start using tools which can only be done on the digital pathology platform that will enhance the diagnosis and the prognosis that we give to our cancer patients, particularly prognosis, um, where we predict how the tumour is going to behave. Um, we do that at the moment, but it depends a lot on subjective assessment of how the tumour looks under the microscope. Digital pathology will enable us to measure some of those differences and that will make it more consistent and reproducible across different hospitals and different departments. So these patients will end up getting uh, more consistent and uh, better, more effective therapy as a result of that. This is a, a big project for the, for the hospital, for the trust and for the medical school. Uh, we are the first centre in the United Kingdom to move to digital pathology for doing our day job, our reporting of cases. This generates an enormous digital archive of cases which we can use to improve things for the future. We've teamed up with our computer scientists, colleagues at Warwick University, who are a very innovative and experienced team looking at uh, digital pathology algorithm development. And we have done quite a lot of work with them already on these tools. So we're set fair now to move into clinical trials to use these tools and show how effective they are and be the first centre in the UK to do that.